Charles Leclerc French pronunciation, Al Elkel, born the 16th of October 1997, is a Monegasque racing driver, currently driving for Scuderia Ferrari in Formula One. Leclerc won the GP3 Series Championship in 2016 and the FIA Formula 2 Championship in 2017. He made his Formula One debut in 2018 for Sauber, a team affiliated with Ferrari, for which he was part of its driver academy. With Sauber having finished last the year before, Leclerc led the charge to improve the finishing position in the Constructors' Championship to eighth, being the highest ranked of the two Sauber drivers. Leclerc has agreed on a contract with Ferrari for the 2019 season where he will drive alongside Sebastian Vettel. Topic: <laughs> Personal life During his childhood, the Monaco-born Leclerc was a friend of the late Jules Bianchi from nearby Nice, who won his first racing championship when Leclerc was 10 years old. Leclerc began karting at the track managed by Bianchi's father in Brignoles. Like Bianchi, Leclerc joined the arm management company headed by Nicolas Tote. In an interview in 2018, Leclerc revealed that Bianchi was also his godfather. Leclerc has two brothers, Lorenzo and Arthur. His father, Hervé, also raced cars, driving in Formula 3 in the 1980s and 1990s, and was well respected in karting. He died after a long illness, aged 54, just four days before his son won the feature race at the 2017 Formula 2 Baku weekend. <laughs> Career Topic. Karting Leclerc began his karting career in 2005, winning the French PACA Championship in 2005, 2006 and 2008. In 2009 he became French cadet champion before moving up to the KF3 class in 2010, where he won the Junior Monaco Kart Cup. He continued in the KF3 class for 2011, winning the CIKFIA KF3 World Cup, the CIKFIA Karting Academy Trophy and the ERDF Junior Kart Masters. During the year, Leclerc also became a member of Nicolas Tote's All Road Management Company. Leclerc graduated to the KF2 category in 2012 with the factory backed Art Grand Prix team, winning the WSK Euro Series title, as well as finishing runner up in the CIKFIA European KF2 Championship and the CIKFIA Under 18 World Karting Championship. In his final year of karting in 2013, Leclerc claimed sixth position in the CIKFIA European KZ Championship and finished second in the CIKFIA World KZ Championship, behind current Red Bull Formula One driver Max Verstappen. <laughs> Formula Renault 2.0 In 2014, Leclerc graduated to single-seaters, racing in the Formula Renault 2.0 Alps Championship for British team Fortec Motorsports. During the season, he took seven podium positions, including a double victory at Monza, to finish runner-up in the championship behind Coiron and GP's NYCK de Vries. Leclerc also won the junior championship title at the final race of the season in Hareth, finishing ahead of Russian teenager Matavos Isakyan. Leclerc also took part in a partial EuroCup Formula Renault 2.0 season with Fortec as a guest driver. In the six races he contested he finished on the podium three times, taking a second place at the Nürburgring followed by a pair of second place finishes at the Hungaroring. <laughs> Formula 3 Leclerc graduated to Formula 3 in 2015, racing in the FIA Formula 3 European Championship with Dutch team Van Amersfoort Racing. At the opening round of the season in Silverstone, Leclerc inherited pole position for the second and third races of the weekend after original pole sitter Felix Rosenquist was excluded for a technical infringement. He went on to take his first race victory in the third race of the weekend, ahead of Antonio Giovinazzi and Jake Dennis. He took his second victory at the following round in Hockenheim, winning the third race as well as taking two additional podiums and three rookie victories over the course of the event. Leclerc scored his third win in the first race at Spa-Francorchamps which saw him take the lead in the championship. However, Leclerc finished fourth in the standings, mostly due to damage sustained to his car's chassis following a collision with Lance Stroll at Zandvoort. 
In November 2015, Leclerc finished second at the Macau Grand Prix. Topic: <laughs> GP3 Series. In December 2015, Leclerc partook in postseason testing with Art Grand Prix and Arden International. In February 2016, De Vries confirmed that Leclerc would race in the 2016 season. Art signed Leclerc the following week. With the team, he claimed three victories and took the title in Abu Dhabi, despite crashing out in the feature race. <laughs> FIA Formula 2 Championship The week following his victory in the GP3 title race, Leclerc was confirmed to be graduating to the series for the 2017 season with Prema Racing. Alongside fellow GP3 racer and Ferrari junior Antonio Fuoco, he made his debut at Bahrain, where he took pole position for the feature race, but only finished third. In the sprint race, his Prema team chose to take a mid race pit stop, which is very uncommon in the shorter sprint races. He pushed harder on his medium Pirelli tires, creating a 9-second lead, before pitting. This would drop him down to 14th place, but Leclerc overtook 13 cars and took victory by overtaking Luca Giotto on the final lap. After taking pole position for the second time in a row, he then fought off Giotto to win again in the Catalunya feature race. Despite a radio issue, Leclerc did not score any points at his home round at the Monaco. He was on pole, but retired from the lead of the race with a suspension problem. The retirement also meant he would start the sprint race from the back of the grid, and in this race he collided with Norman Nato whilst trying to make his way up the grid, which ultimately resulted in both drivers retiring from the race. He retained the championship lead despite the bad weekend, which he described as hugely disappointing. Leclerc took a fourth consecutive pole at a race Azerbaijan, which he dedicated to his late father, Hervé. He converted this into another win, although the race was red flagged five laps before the scheduled end. In the sprint race, he started from 8th, and dropped to 10th early on, but fought back to 6th. The retirement of the race leader, his title rival Oliver Rowland, and De Vries, who was also ahead of Leclerc, meant Leclerc improved to 4th. He then passed Nicholas Latifi and Jordan King, and began to close on the new leader, Nato. He passed Nato, but had been given a 10-second penalty for failing to slow for yellow flags, and therefore finished second. In Austria he took his fifth pole position, and then won the feature race from pole despite coming under pressure from teammate Fuoco, and towards the end, the dams of Latifi. He would retire from the sprint race after colliding with Fuoco and spinning out. By taking pole for the sixth time for the next race, at Silverstone, he matched the record for most pole positions in a row, which was set by Stoffel van Dorn in 2014 and 2015, when the series were called GP2 Series. He won the feature race, even after his car set alight during the race, and even after one of his wing mirrors detached in the closing stages, he would not start from pole in Hungary, despite taking his seventh successive pole position, as he was disqualified for a technical infringement. Despite starting from the back, he was in 12th position by turn 1. Using an alternative tire strategy that saw him start on the medium tires, Leclerc was stuck behind Alexander Albon, who was on the same strategy, although he eventually got past and would finish 4th. He would also finish 4th in the sprint race the next day, giving him a 50-point championship lead over Roland. For the Belgian rounds, Leclerc again took pole and won the race by a convincing margin of over 20 seconds, however his win was disqualified as one of his skid blocks was excessively worn. Having to start in 19th place, Leclerc managed to go back up to 5th place and finish 3.8 seconds behind the race winner, Sergio Set Camara. For the Italian feature race, Leclerc was battling for the lead however on the final lap, he was involved in an accident with De Vries. After starting towards the back of the grid for the second consecutive sprint race, Leclerc managed to fight his way back to ninth position, albeit out of the points. With a 57-point margin over Roland heading into the penultimate rounds at Herath, Leclerc gained his eighth pole position of the season, with both of his timed laps being good enough for pole position. In the feature race, Leclerc dominated most of the early stint on soft tires and was able to overtake most of the runners on the alternate strategy. With seven laps to go however, Nobuharu Matsushita collided with Santino Ferrucci, which brought out the safety car. At the point that the race resumed, Leclerc was misinformed over team radio that it was the last lap, even though there were four laps to go, so after pushing hard to build a gap Leclerc's tires were 
overheated badly, with several laps still to run, yet despite his tires being completely gone. By the end Leclerc managed to hold off a charging Roland by 0.23 seconds, and claim the FIA Formula 2 championship in his rookie season in the main F1 feeder series. In claiming the championship, Leclerc became the youngest ever champion of the main support series for Formula 1 at 19 years 356 days old, and the first driver since Nico Hülkenberg in 2009 to win the championship in their rookie season a feat which only Nico Rosberg and Lewis Hamilton have previously accomplished and is the only driver to claim a championship with the Dallara GP2 11th chassis in their rookie season. For the sprint race, Leclerc started in 8th place, however due to his car's aggressive setup, he and his teammate, Antonio Fuoco, had to pit in the sprint race. Due to the aggressive pace of Leclerc however, he rose up through the field, yet because of the excessive wear on his tires, he conceded three positions on the final lap and finished in 7th position. For the final rounds at Abu Dhabi, Leclerc qualified in 6th place for the feature race, his lowest starting position all season barring penalties. Despite this however, he managed to finish the highest of the alternate strategy runners in Abu Dhabi soft then super soft in fourth place he had made it up till third until the final corner of the final lap where he was pipped by Antonio Fuoco. This position however was subsequently changed to second after the race winner, Oliver Rowland, and Fuoco were disqualified for excessive floor wear and under inflated front tires respectively. For Leclerc's final race, he started in seventh position. He was initially able to make up two places but was running slower than the race leaders Alexander Albin and Nicholas Latifi. As the race progressed however, Leclerc started gaining time compared to his rivals and managed to take Latifi with a few laps to go. For the final three laps, DRS was disabled and yellow flags in the final sector meant that Leclerc was stuck behind Albin, however on the final lap, both drivers tangled, triggered by Leclerc nudging Albin, and both had a drag race which they constantly were pushing each other until Leclerc finally took the lead and won by 1.293 seconds his final victory in his last ever F2 race. Formula One. In March 2016, it was announced that Leclerc would be one of two drivers to join the Ferrari Driver Academy and would act as development driver for Haas F1 team and Scuderia Ferrari. As part of his role as development driver, Leclerc participated in the first practice session of the 2016 British Grand Prix driving for Haas. It was believed that if Leclerc won the GP3 Series Championship, he would follow Daniil Kvyat and Valtteri Bottas direct from GP3 into F1 with Haas. However this was debunked by Haas team principal Gunther Steiner who said that Leclerc would progress to the 2017 FIA Formula 2 Championship. He took part in the mid-season Hungaroring test following the Hungarian Grand Prix, driving the Ferrari SF70H. He was fastest on the first day of the test, running 98 laps in the process, but did not take part in the second day's test. Sauber 2018. In December 2017, it was announced that Leclerc would make his racing debut in Formula One, signing with the newly rebranded Alfa Romeo Sauber F1 team as regular driver for 2018, thus marking the first appearance of a Monegasque Formula One driver since Olivier Beretta in 1994. At the 2018 Azerbaijan Grand Prix, a sixth place finish saw him become only the second Monegasque to score points in Formula One, after Lewis Chiron finished on the podium at the 1950 Monaco Grand Prix. Topic. Ferrari 2019. On the 11th of September 2018, Leclerc was announced by Scuderia Ferrari for the 2019 season, replacing Kimi Raikkonen, who will move to Sauber. While initially only announced for 2019, a few days later, Ferrari team principal Maurizio Arrivabene indicated that Leclerc's contract was going to be four seasons long, running at least until 2022. Leclerc made his first test day as an official Ferrari race driver on 28 November 2018 in Abu Dhabi. Racing record Career summary 
As Leclerc was a guest driver, he was ineligible for championship points. Topic: <laughs> Complete FIA Formula 3 European Championship results. Key races in bold indicate pole position. Races in italics indicate fastest lap. Topic: <laughs> Complete GP3 series results. Key races in bold indicate pole position. Races in italics indicate fastest lap. Topic. <laughs> Complete FIA Formula 2 Championship results Key Races in bold indicate pole position, races in italics indicate fastest lap. Topic. Complete Formula 1 results Key Races in bold indicate pole position, races in italics indicate fastest lap did not finish, but was classified as he had completed more than 90% of the race distance. <laughs> Notes